The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From the pits of hell, weighing in at 381 pounds, the Intercontinental Champion, the Prince Damian D. Shane. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. Willing to bet these two have absolutely no plans on spending Thanksgiving dinner together at any point in the near future. I hate Thanksgiving. the bell and here we go we're all along for the ride on this one but make no mistake about it we're going to have a winner yeah that social media has been on fire ahead of this one but now it's time to get down to business the greatest sports entertainment in the world regardless this wait a minute what is this about you don't see that move every day Okay, guys, I wanted to talk a little bit about The Undertaker here. It's still early, but I really like his chances here tonight. He certainly looks more focused than I remember seeing him in recent weeks. High impact, no mistakes. That's Undertaker style. I don't know how much more of this that back can take. You can't do much offense with a pad wing.
The Undertaker is certainly not someone to sleep on. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. Yeah, that may be felt for a lifetime. Well, if you want to talk about a commanding ring presence, the discussion begins and ends with The Undertaker. Indeed, King. I mean, I'd go so far as to say that just in terms of creating a fear factor in an opponent, the demon from Death Valley is unmatched. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. I couldn't have said it better myself. Which is a little scary considering it came from your mouth, JBL. He drops the elbow. Hey, come on. There's no need for this. King, just like you said a moment ago, you hear the word fear mentioned more often when it comes to The Undertaker than when it comes to any other WWE superstar. Right. Just think about all the superstars that felt that little bit of fear each time they stood across the ring from the dead man. Oh, Michael, I think you're right. Though I don't think any WWE superstar will admit that they were scared against anyone, even if it is The Undertaker. But I think every superstar that's faced the phenom would agree that there definitely is something different about standing face to face with The Undertaker. I mean, you get the sense that there's something supernatural about him. Let's just say it's a frightening experience. Nice reversal. I can breathe. Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This might be it. Hot damn, it's exciting. I think he has to find a way to rally here and fast. Some serious power right there. Cover here. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. That may be the first time we've seen that executed. TV on Thursday, but nothing more can't miss than this broadcast of WWE television. Looking to take out the leg. He may get the three count right there. Going to be close. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. I'm with you, Chang. I don't know if anybody could have. I don't know where he's finding the strength to stay in this one. Remember Thursday, Raw Thursday? How many times do we need to say Thursday in one title? In any event, thanks for tuning in on this Thursday evening. He's making a statement here with this attack. And oh, the weapon of mass destruction! No kidding! Whoa! A direct hit! Talk about getting tagged and knocked in the middle of next week. Yeah, and he's not looking too good now. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't throw up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. What a move. Now that's a finishing move. This thing, could this be it? I think so. so much of that. He saw that one coming. Oh, he's in trouble now. And the officials seen it up. The officials throwing him out. Not where you want to be with the dead man. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Starting to tire. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. And not only what we've seen so far is any indication of what's to come. I fully expect him to go for that finish it again the next time he sees an opening. Guys, I've lost count of how many finishers this guy's gone for. 
Eventually, it might be time to try something else. Oh, jeez! Knocked into next week! Extra slow getting back to his base here. Out of the ring! Now what's gonna happen? And it's The Undertaker, able to break through. Okay, once you get outside the ring, anything can happen. Yeah, and it usually does. Over the years, I've seen more careers come to an abrupt end outside of the ring than I can remember. This area is so dangerous. He's making a statement here with this attack. I'm not sure I can watch this. displaying a never-say-die attitude. It was as if winning was the only option here tonight. And it's matches like this one that makes SmackDown such a success. Thank you so much for joining us.